Thank you for coming to my channel. So today we have another haul. And this haul is a little different for me. It's not something I've ever done. This is going to be a Shein haul. I have never ever ordered anything from Shein, but I see people doing the app and somebody requested that I should do it. So I went online and I ordered this few pieces from Shein because I was a little bit skeptic because I didn't know if it was going to be good merchandise or not. And anyway, I went ahead and I pulled the trigger and I ordered some stuff for Shein. Needless to say, I wasn't that happy. But being that everybody wanted to know, and I was a little bit curious, so I decided I was going to do it. But anyway, guys, please like and subscribe to my channel. Subscribe, subscribe. Thank you for stopping by. Hit the notification bell. Share, comment, good comments only, please. Anyway, so let's start with what I'm wearing. This beautiful, I don't, I don't know. I kind of like the dress. I think this is one of the only pieces I love. I got this nice little dress all the way down to my knee from Shein. Look at that. I mean, yeah, it's kind of cute. I think this dress was on sale for $15. It has a little lycra. This is one of the best things I got at that site. It's a little bit thin. It's not heavy, which means you can take this all the way to spring. So I'm liking this. And if I was to wear this, I would style it with this beautiful bag I got from good old Burlington. Caviar leather. It's not a Burlington haul. But I just want to show you guys what I'm, how I'm going to style this. So here we go. Beautiful. Yeah. Love it. And I also styling it with a pair of um, shoes I got from Burlington. I don't know if you guys can see it, but here we go, it's all the way. Nice, Catherine Malandrino. Ankle, open toe boots. But the dress comes all the way down to my ankle. I mean, it's, it's, it's really okay. I mean, this is one of the few items I think I liked out of this haul. But, um, hold on guys. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Anyway, so yeah, love the dress. Sorry, I had to grab something. But anyway, let's try this dress with the next item I got, which is this um, cardigan slash, I mean, not cardigan, jacket slash dress, double breasted. I don't think you can wear it as a dress because the buttons don't go all the way down. But it's kind of like um parachute fabric. It's kind of a nylon-y, like a raincoat fabric. And um, I think this one was on sale for $19. The fabric looks a little cheap. I mean, I don't know what I was expecting. But like I say, this is my first time ordering from Shein. So let me try it on and we get to see what we can do with this jacket. Actually, let me take off my bangle because it's getting on my nerves. Here we go. Double breasted. this way so I took a large because I know these are Chinese um, clothing so I wasn't too sure about the sizing so I decided to get a large it's cute I like the fact that that the design is cute but the fabric is really 
kind of chippy. I don't know what I'm going to wear this to. I don't know. Maybe just running errands on a day where it's not so cold. It's okay. I don't like this little plastic tortoise shell they got on the belt. Puffy sleeves. Guess it's okay for the price. What do I, what was I expecting for nineteen dollars? Don't know. I'm expecting more than I am paid for. You get what you pay for, pretty much. But anyway, so I can wait double breasted, or I can wear it open, just like a little trench coat. I think this is what this is. It's more of a trench. The only thing about this that I do not like. Is the fact that it has no pockets I need pockets if I'm gonna wear a trench like this I need to be able to put my hand in a pocket I mean it's kind of cute rock it with this beautiful light pink bag from Burlington and this is by Isabella almost look like a Chanel not a Burlington haul, but I just want to show you all the bag. It's really cute. And look at this outfit. As cheap as this outfit is, everything I have on here is less than $100. The shoes was $19. The bag was $30. The trench coat was $19. The dress was $15. So, you do the math. But anyway, for my first time, I know I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna go back to Shein, but I just thought I should do it. Sorry guys. Try it on. So you guys get to see it. And my for me to satisfy my curiosity. Because I'm like, I keep hearing about this site. Shein, Shein, what is it about? I mean some people had the nerve to compare this with Zara. No. Well anyway, Zara is kind of shitty right now, so it could be. But no, this is more like Forever 21 comparison, not Zara. I don't think so, not to my opinion. So that was that jacket. It's more like a spring jacket. So I would say this is more of a spring haul. The next jacket was this beautiful camel color. Loose. Now, does this have a pocket? Probably not. So I don't know what's up with Shein. They make jackets and they don't put pockets on them. Like who does that? You need a pocket. You need to put your hand. This is cool, but once more, they have a drawstring where you can singe it to make it a little tighter. Here's the back. Here's the front. It's kind of pretty me you can wear as long as you're not taking it to somewhere fancy you can just wear this around town running errands and you know hey i love the lapel i love the fact that it has this flappy lapel and if you want to close it you could so let's try i don't know what is it with this cheapest rope they gave they gave you a rope as a form of a belt. It's like, what the hell is going on? Look at that. Like, why would I even want to cinch this with a rope? I mean, I love the back. But it's worse with this rope. I mean, that's to make it tighter. And it's just like, just a plain black rope. It's ridiculous. I mean, here we go. You can make the sleeves a little longer, but you know, I probably would not wear it like that. This is what the sleeves look like. If it's not cinched, it's okay. Not the best. This fabric is better than the other one that I just took off. Beautiful. So I will probably style this with Something simple with this beautiful bag, embossed, croc, gorgeous. 
this is more like a fashion bag not a designer but it's cute as hell so i can wear this run around town or go somewhere maybe with my hobby which i don't have to try so hard go out to grab something to eat or for drinks you know in california it does get cold in the evening so i would definitely wear this in the evening and then um carry this little bag and yeah okay this jacket too was i believe 19 dollars because i wasn't paying that much for something i don't know nothing about so 19 dollars was my cutoff i wasn't paying 29 i wasn't paying 39 i don't know the site so i was gonna keep it simple and cheap so yeah i love this but i wish it had a pocket i don't know why they don't put pockets on their merchandise what's going on all right the next jacket was another camo color one this is a little bit heavy and this is flare on the bottom now this too wow does it have a pocket what's going on no pocket double breasted kind of looks like a corduroy fabric look at that it's a little bit heavier than the other ones i kind of like this this has a little bit of substance so once more this was a large like i say i wasn't sure with the sizing for Shein, because I've never bought anything from the site before, as you can see. It's a little tight on my boobies. So, I'm top heavy, so here we go. Let's tie this baby up. This is cute. This I can rock. I'm loving this one. This is gorgeous. Yeah. Once more, no pocket. I don't get it. How you gonna make a beautiful jacket? I don't put a pocket. I mean, I'm liking this. I really am. So another $19. All the jackets I think were 19. Like I said, that was my cutoff. And um, I can just, instead of doing the monochromatic look, I could just put a red bag. Just give it a little color. Oh. Beautiful Tahari bag. Love this look. Yeah. So, this is what I will rock this with. Gorgeous. Oh, I can just do the black bag again. Or better yet, I can do a backpack. So, if I was running errands, Big bags are in, guys. The big bags are all over the runway. This is a beautiful caviar fashion bag. Almost look like Chanel, but I got this at Burlington. So, yeah. So I can rock that with the backpack, run my errands, hands free, do what I need to do, and I'm good. Now, if I get too busy, which I don't like doing, but hey. Sidebar. I love this jacket. I can play with this a whole lot. Yes. This is cute. I'm liking this. So, we like this jacket from Shein. This is good. And if I wanted to do it as oh, not so dressy, I can open it up and just let it fly through. Tie the belt in the back. This reminds me of, the style reminds me of a Zara jacket I got years ago. S same exact, exact style, but Zara, the fabric was a whole lot better and heavier. So, here we go with Chi In. 
right. It's nice. I love the flowiness. This is just too cute. Okay, with this beautiful dress. Why not if it, these two pieces was the best items I got from Shein, I think. Right. So, anyway, let's try another jacket. Sorry if you have to see my panty lines. Wrong underwear, but here we go. A little bit TMI. Let's try another one. Ouch, Lord. I want to break my head. The next jacket from Shein. Oh, yeah. This too was a size large. I think I told you guys. Now, this is like a winter jacket. This is hairy bone. It's like a hairy bone kind of fabric. Very heavy. Beautiful. Now, I was a little suspect about this. It doesn't say she in on the label, which tells me maybe this is their premium line because this this is nicer and this is really heavy. Look at that. So big. So, yeah, I took a large and it's extremely big. I think I would have done better with a medium. Kind of heavy. I like it, but it's so big. Look at it. Huge. Huge. So, but anyway. Kind of nice. And once more, this one has pockets. Now, we have Houston, we have a problem. This pocket is good. I cannot put my hand, this pocket on this side is sewn backwards. So my hand cannot literally go in <laughs> as this one. Where the hell is it? Look at that. So this, as much as I love this jacket, this is defective. Look at my hand. Look at my hand. It cannot go any further. See, that's why I don't like buying from clothing from places I don't know nothing about. I caught myself trying to be inquisitive and curious and do a Shein haul. Yeah, this would have been really nice if it was done properly. You know, guys, do you see? Oh, God, it's huge. It's big, it's heavy. Should have taken a small. It has pockets, which I love, but one pocket is not functional, and the other one is. Let's style this with this bag. And God, this is this would have been so cute, but hey, look at that! I can't. I can fake it, but no. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with this jacket. I just just don't know. I love the fact that it has full sleeves. Love it. It's heavy as hell. And you can see it's like a herringbone fabric. Very good fabric. Very well made, but defective. Carry with this bag. It's kind of look like a house robe, but it would have been the best if this worked. It would have been so cute. Okay, well, let's just pretend we don't need the pocket. So this is how I'm going to wear this. Ooh, it's a little heavy. I might have to just do that. Wear it like this. Tie the belt in the back like we do. And here we go. This is what the back would look like. Like, see, it kind of swallows me up, but hey, I, I could rock it easily. I don't know. I might have to take this to my tailor and have him fix the pocket because I don't know. I don't like sending stuff back. Like I said, it gives me anxiety. I'm not the one. I'd rather give it away or alter it or throw it out but that's that these two even though 
it doesn't say she in on here. Let me see if it does say it on the bottom. Oh yeah, it does. He says it on here, which means, I guess this is a different line. Is this their premium line? I don't know. If this is their premium line and then it's defective, then they got a problem. It's kind of heavy. I think, I think this one cost me a little bit more. I did say my cutoff was 19. Maybe I lied a little. I think this one was 24. 24, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, I could have been 19. Then I got another jacket that I thought was a little shitty, fabric-wise. This is not what it looked like on the mannequin. It's very lightweight. It feels like if you wash it one time, it's going to shrink. And it came all wrinkled up. I tried to um, steam it as much as I could to get the wrinkles out, but not so much. The buttons are cheap to shiny. And this was cheap. This was, I think, $9. So this is something you wear one time and then throw it away. Because honestly, you cannot keep this in your closet for next season. It's, it's just like a one-time wear, I think, my opinion. It's cute. The idea is cute, but the fabric is really cheap. I mean, it's supposed to be, even if it's just cotton, it could have been a little bit heavier. You can wear this with some jeans. You can wear it with a skirt. Even wear it with this dress. God, the idea is really good. I love the flap in the back, but the fabric is just dead cheap really cheap so i don't even know if i'm gonna be washing this probably what the hell oh a fake flap it's not even a pocket uh, this was nine dollars but see for nine dollars i can get something designer from either burlington or tj maxx this jacket i don't know maybe i just wear it to the grocery store and call it a day yeah one time wear after that the soda. It becomes trash. Rubbish. Shein. Why do people shop from this side? I don't know. But anyway. To each his own. So I was not happy. I could have used my money and go to uh, TJ Maxx. Valentine. Marshalls. And gave me some designer pieces. For this amount instead of getting all this rubbish from a Chinese site called Shein. Another thing I got was this blouse on sale too. Pinstripe. Kind of. Let's see. I like I like anything that you have to tie around the neck. You can make a nice bow around the neck that's what caught my eye because i do love the full sleeves that are in the season and the bows and all the good stuff look at that let me put it on so we get to see it and so we know what we're working with i mean i have this dress on i'm not going to take it off it's, it was a little struggle, you know, to pull it down my body. You know, like I say, I'm heavy top. And this dress I got in the medium, this dress. So I wanted it to cinch me and it did just that. So here's the blouse. Full, full neck. It's kind of, let's button this blouse so we get to see. I don't know why they have a headband on, but oh well. Just show you guys my big old head. My big old forehead. But anyway, yeah, this forehead used to, I used to model with this head, but now the older I get, the bigger I think it gets. But anyway, here we go. Here's the blouse. This is one of the reasons 
I bought this blouse because of this long sleeve. Love it. Yeah. So I can rock this with some jeans. Tuck it in. Gorgeous. I don't think I did a good job with this boat. Now, did I? Yeah. Extremely long. But I like it. More of a, a backpack kind of attire with some jeans on. And there you go. Beautiful. I'm just imagining I have jeans or maybe a skirt. I had to tuck it in or put a beautiful belt around it. We can belt it up. And so, yeah, this was the main attraction. And I think this was $9. I was happy with this one. Nine dollars. The fabric is not cutting. It's more like like a nylon fabric, which means it will not shrink. Yeah, to that. Yeah, you can feel the fabric. Love that. So, anywho. This is it for my, I think this is it for the she and her. Oh, wait, what size did I get this in? Let me see. Because I know it was on sale. And when I try to put one size and it says out of stock, and I grabbed another size. So let's see what size this is. So in case you guys want to go try and get it. Oh, this is a large. And once more, this I think is the better. I don't know which is the better quality for Shein. Is it the white tag or the black tag? Because honestly, I can't tell. So this is the white tag. And I think the the white tag is the better quality. This is the, the black tag is a whole lot shitty looking. The white tag to me looks prettier. So this one and this jacket have a white tag. This would have been the bomb if it was not defective with the pocket. These are the ones with the, the black tag, I believe this is the, yeah. Black tag, the fabric, not so much. But, you know, to be desired. Yeah, these are all the black tags. Even though I love this jacket, it's a little bit heavier and this is a little bit wonky. You know, look at that. More like a spring lightweight jacket. But anyway, so I did the Shein haul, yay. And this beautiful dress, I think I got in the medium. And this dress was, if I'm not mistaken, I don't know, $12, $9. Love it. Sorry, guys. I don't want to show you guys. I'm not wearing the right, right penny. I don't need to do no penny liners. But anyway, so that's it for the Shein haul. I tried it. Uh, my ratings for this site, for what I got from a scale to 10, I would give it a five. Yeah, I'll give it a five. It's not, it's not a site that I'm going to run back to, to say, oh, let me go to Shein and buy stuff. No, I'm not doing that. Only reason being is their merchandise is not going to last me a long time. I don't just want to buy stuff just to buy stuff because it's cheap. Don't get me wrong, but I can get good quality items from H&M for the price I paid at Shein and good quality and designers from Burlington and and Ross and TJ Maxx and Marshalls. This is not a site I want to put in my closet. I don't know about you guys. Matt, no. I give it a five. So that's it for the Shein haul. And I don't know if I'm going to give them a second chance. We'll see. But I doubt it. Seriously. And if I was to do it, it's maybe just some few pieces that I think I could just play with and then Later on, just donate it and chuck it away. But I don't want to waste my money. I like to buy good quality merchandise. 
I just don't like buying stuff because it's a cheap site. No. Anyway, enough of my rambling, guys. Thank you for this, for coming by. This is the end of the Shein haul. Um, I keep telling you guys I have another haul coming. I'm waiting for a few items. I don't know if it's Chinese New Year. I want to do my replica haul, but there's one particular bag I'm waiting for. And so far, it's not here. So if it doesn't come by Monday, I'll just go ahead and do the haul. If not, I have a whole lot of other hauls to do. I have a Ross haul. I have a Burlington haul. I have a Didi's haul. I have a Marshall haul. So we're just going to see. I'm just, replica haul is what I know you guys love to see, but I don't just want to do a couple of bags. I want to do like maybe three items because I have like four bags I can do a haul, but. I was waiting for one particular bag so we can just go ahead and do it and call it a day but anyway guys thank you like and subscribe to my channel and love you guys for stopping by hope to see you next time okay guys mm, peace and love love you guys yeah yeah bye